All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another Airsoft video. Today we are back at Milsom City here in Utah. As you guys can tell, the video is still kind of grainy right now, and that is due to my new setting on my camera, which was the ISO setting. This was on Friday night. Saturday, I get everything cleaned up and fixed for you. All right, it's basically like Team Deathmatch, in that when you get shot, you go back to your spawn point. You're gonna have a five man, you have five people inside of your respawn at all times. That way we can thin out the herd a little bit still. The key with the Reapers is these guys wearing the yellow vest. You cannot kill them, you shoot them, you die. So as you just heard there from the owner of the field, this match is called nice. Reapers. That's the first. He's like trying to find you or you're trying to kill me. <laughs> Basically, they cannot be killed. If you shoot them, they die. And then they go on what's called a Reaper Rage Mode where they run around screaming for 20 seconds, killing everybody. So pick and shoot your shots. I think I only come here whenever they change the map. See, me and my kids, we come here like every Friday and Saturday, so yeah. it was kind of nice to have something change. So that guy's name I was talking to, I believe is John. Super, super awesome guy. I like him a lot, really good player. So here I'm trying to push the middle hard. Gotta watch out for these Reapers, man. They'll come after you. All the banging noise you hear are the Reapers slamming their axes on the wall trying to uh, push people out of their camping spots. Because if you get touched by a Reaper, you gotta take a knee for 20 seconds and count. And then you can go back to respawn. Here I pick up a couple of kills. Pick up about three kills right there. And I'm peeking through the crack of these plywood boards here because I see people moving around. And I'm picking up another kill right there. And I'm using pistol only again this match in case you guys haven't been able to tell. It is just my uh, Cyber Gun 1911 uh, CO2 blowback pistol, for those of you who uh, really cared what I'm using. So I've got a Reaper behind me, so I'm trying to push up a little harder. Come into this room, pick up two more kills. Almost get friendly fired right there. I'm trying to flag to my guys that he almost just shot me. Shot the wood right next to my head. Change the magazines. So I almost shot the Reaper right there. So that's why I backed off and waited until he left that area. So right here, you'll see, I'm shooting this guy. I've hit him again and again and again and again. I missed that one, but I've hit him again. And I'm like, uh, and then I just took a ricochet. I'm trying to tell my teammates that, hey, that's me. They're shooting in there and they're ricocheting the walls and hitting my helmet. So I don't know if that guy was just wearing a lot of padding, but uh, he wasn't feeling any of that. I'm also trying to flag my teammates to get up here with me. They're all way back there at the car and I'm trying to get them to come up here with me. And then I see another guy. I hit him again. Again, and again, and again. Then I hit him again, and then he finally sees me shooting at him, and then he calls himself out. Enemy's down. I'm thinking what's happening is that since I'm using a pistol, is maybe they're not quite feeling it. Uh, and then I shoot this guy. Maybe they're just not quite feeling it from that distance. Because pistols aren't quite as powerful. I mean, I think my pistol's shooting 330 feet per second, so I'm thinking they should feel it from that distance. And then this guy. End up picking this guy trying to sneak up on me. I end up getting quite a few kills in this little position right here. I'm still trying to flag my teammates. And then I get reaped, finally. They end up finding my little location, 
and reaping me. <laughs> you okay, Hayes? <laughs> Oh, I'm, sorry. Oh, that one hurt. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm glad you got him. <laughs> so basically what happened there, as you guys saw, um, he poked out the wrong time. I shot him right in the thumb and he shot me in the chest. So <laughs> hand shots are no fun. They do not feel good, even through gloves. That's our guy in the tower. Are you shooting at him up there? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's our guy up there. See, he's got green. <laughs> so I was just letting him know that that is green up there and he was like I didn't see that so I was just trying to prevent some friendly fire is all almost <laughs> Uh oh. <laughs> that goes half My boots keep coming unlaced, and I almost fell on a red guy. That's not good. So I'm trying to tell him that I've got, I can hear somebody on the other side of this wall here. That guy's not calling a kick. I've had a few of those already. Yeah, that burger's not calling a kick. And then right here, I don't know if yeah, I, I uh, clearly missed that guy, so I see that he moved. I crawl under the window and then pop back up and then shoot him right in the hand right here. Yep, he's down now. <laughs> Whoa, got three of them on this corner. Things get pretty heated right here, but I'm going to wrap this video up, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed another Airsoft video, and we'll see you all hey. next time. Good shot.